this video, we're going to be talking about email marketing via KB Core. My name is Samila Rajasingham, licensed realtor with EXP Realty Brokerage based in Toronto. And if you want to get access to top social media course and legion tools to scale your business and to dominate your market, then partner with me to get access to all of these tools for free. And click on the link below in the description to book a one-on-one -on -one with me. So I'll be happy to show you what these are. Thank you so much, guys. I'm going to just uh, make the image a little bit smaller so that you can see a, a, more of what I'm going to show you in the back end of KB Core today. Super excited to have you. So let's pull that to the side a little bit. And right now what you're looking at is the back end of KB Core. And obviously, for those that work inside KB Core, you'll know that you have to use your credentials So when you with our brokerage. So when you join the XP Realty brokerage, you'll have access to free access to the this robust CRM, lead gen, website, IDX integrated tool. And in the back end, you can go and obviously use it, your EXP Realty credentials to log in. And you'll get to a page that looks like this. And this is work on the listings um, tab because I don't want to click on the dashboard of smart CRM for privacy reasons because it has personal information of some of my uh, leads and clients as well um, so today in particular we're going to be exploring email marketing how to create templates and how to use them when you're sending out emails on a monthly weekly basis so this is um, and you know I have a background in marketing and I've done numerous marketing campaigns using email marketing um, and to me uh, having a system, a categorized system of CRM, it's all about your database and what you're sending and your goal of your email marketing. So when you're really thinking, sorry, that's my son <laughs> in the background, but it's really important when you're putting together your campaign, you understand the goal and intention of your email. I currently send out on a monthly basis to my database, to everyone on my database, to a market report. And depending on some of the videos that I have on YouTube, which is consumer focused, uh, on our channel we send out what um if it's about you know moving to scarborough or something about a geographical area where someone's looking into moving in or purchasing a property for then we send it to buyers and if it's something about listing a property then we send it to sellers so it's really important which i'll do another video about this about categorizing your and organizing your crm in kb core so today you're going to click on the left hand menu uh, marketing autopilot And you're going to see the first square that says Smart Campaigns, and you're going to click on Start a Campaign. To the side. So, once you arrive at this page, you'll see that at the top it says Campaign Library and Templates. You're going to click on Templates. And then you're going to see uh, a number of different templates that are available for you. So, email, text messages, call, um, you know, and etc. So today we're going to add a template. You're going to create your own template this way that you can, uh, you know, it's easy to send out emails on a monthly basis. Sorry, I didn't realize that my son's going to be making too much noise, but that's okay. <laughs> well, you get to hear his lovely voice, don't you? Okay. So when you're creating a template, you know, for the sake of this template, I'm just going to say test two because I've done one already for me in the past. So you know, when you're creating an email, um, I personally like to use the advanced editor because you're creating a marketing piece. So you want it to really put together and leverage some of the tools that are available through KV Core. So let's open up the advanced editor compared to the basic editor, which is just text only. So when you have this template, I, you know, I'm going to give you just a, an example of what are some of the features that are available to you so that you have flexibility in how you want to create your own templates um, and have it according to your brand. So you have a you know, blank canvas right here, and you have a number of different tools that are available through here. I'm going to make my image a little bit smaller so that you're able to see more of the content. So let's say when you're building this out, you may want to, of course, um, have maybe your logo and a text right at the top here. You may want to have some more content like that and some more content like that and then let's fill this in i always like to add maybe a text right at the top maybe it's a quote or maybe your tagline and then you'll have the title of the email that can go on here whether it's you know february market report or whatever that you would like to do um or toronto market report etc and you want to add maybe your logo right in the corner so it's always branded and then you want to gum when you i like to always give people an image maybe um you know 
a, a, a graphic image of uh, showing you uh, some sort of a creative that shows you exactly what the market stats are so that people can visually see. But it's super important to also do a quick write-up, a summary of what the market uh, is and giving people an analysis of what is happening in the neighborhood. So maybe you want to add a little bit of text in there and then the image, the graphic that you want to add in here that's pertained to your market report for that month, uh, which is available through your real estate board. And you might want to add maybe a video that you did about a particular property that's in around that area that you may want to add, etc. And I love about this is that you can always add a footer for you as well as social media links as well right at the bottom. And obviously, I like to have make sure that everything is to brand. So all of our, my, our brand colors are black, white, and gray. So I like to always come here and choose the color that fits your brand and add in the links accordingly. And remember guys, you have this app option available to you. So let's say you don't have LinkedIn pages. You can delete that, but you may have YouTube account, so you can come here and add YouTube. So there's a number of different links and social media um, icons that are available for you. So let's say that you're really happy with this template and it works for you. You are going to save, add this template and maybe, yep, and then you want to add this template let's get that saved and now oh you need to put in a you know let's put in test two and let's add this template and we're going to go back now to marketing autopilot again and go back into the email function so send mass emails so the scheduled mass email function is in this page as well right here and you're going to click schedule an email and now we're going to go put that template to use. So let's schedule an email. You're going to click schedule an email. You're going to come here and you're going to use the template that, that we just created. So let's look up test two. There you go. And it's going to pull up your template that you just made. And you're going to obviously edit accordingly because this month is a different month than the month that you've done last time so that's the point of a template right folks that you want to be able to leverage this tool so don't have to keep rebuilding it every time month to month so you're going to come in here rechange some of the copy here so that pertains to that month's market report you're going to change the image to ensure that your creative fits that month's market report and anything else that might have changed for you to kind of beef up this content and change maybe the content here for the video and maybe you are thinking about sending it and it's ready to go and i always like to send do a preview look at the email i also like to send a text because sometimes i like to add emojis in some of my content and i realize that they don't always show up and i don't know that until i do a test to check that out and the most important and i'm going to do a video on this so keep an eye out for it is using your contacts accordingly so every content that you make you want to send it with intention so i always go back to that goal why are you sending this email to whom and what kind of response are you looking for? So when you think about it that way, I like to always go by, you know, this is why I want to do, do that video about categorizing your contacts because they're categorized by hashtags. So this one in particular is a market report. I send it to everybody in my database. But in this particular case, you may want it to just send it to your buyer. So you will come here and put in your buyers and then you will have it sent out. So be really thoughtful and intentional as to whom you're going to be sending this out to. But there you have it, folks, how to create an email template and to send out a scheduled email. So email marketing on autopilot via KB Core. And I hope this was valuable for you. And if you have any questions in terms of how to leverage this tool to the next level, feel free to get in touch with me. My information is in the description. And if you have any questions or if you found this video useful or insightful, please leave a comment below. I would love to be in touch with you. And again, like I mentioned earlier, if you love to join my team and to partner with me to have access to all these tools that we have available um, in our group, feel free to check the link to my calendar in the description and book a one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, thank you so much for joining in and watching our video. Have a wonderful day.